today is okay today is uh, October 17th 2009 as you can see for the first time the truck is sitting outside the shop that is it's moving on its own power now now we've still got a lot of things to do to it like this headlight the one of the students is having problems wiring that headlight back up after we removed the front end I have found a place for the uh, ECU I think we're going to stick it over there in that corner right there but as you can see the fender wells are in now and I think it has made the whole uh, look underneath the hood a lot cleaner. It gives us a little more room to work with now. Uh, and what I'm fixing to do is I'm fixing to go get inside it and drive it and just move it around uh, the parking lot here. Uh, this well does not have any brakes on it right now because you can see this brake hose hanging down here. The... Uh, Park stores that any of the local park stores around none of the local park stores around here have a, a brake hose that will fit a 2004 Crown Victoria. The only place I found is the Ford dealership, and they want 60 bucks. I do have a friend working at a park store that is working on getting us one, but for right now, we've got the wrong brake hose on it, and it won't fit the caliper because it's off an earlier model Crown Vic. And so, I've just got a, a cl clamp there keeping the brake pressure in, so I can't really drive it very much safely but I'm just going to show y'all that it does run now and it does move we got the drive shaft made let's see if I can get a shot of that that drive shaft is pretty uh, we got that made in Rossville Georgia close to Chattanooga Tennessee uh, the drive shaft had to be 77 inches long to replace the two piece, two piece drive shaft it had originally I'm going to give the uh, camera to my son here, and he's going to uh, do the rest. several other things we've got to dress like the brake hose uh, got to get some stuff the interior is still finished on it uh, but it runs now I hope in the next few weeks we'll have it going completely at least mechanically speaking and later on we'll try to get somebody to help us out with the cosmetics of the truck uh, until then I'm probably not going to do any more videos till this thing is totally ready the next video I want to do this thing to post on YouTube is going to be with it going down a regular highway. So uh, I hope to have that done within the next few weeks to a month to uh, sew up all these little bitty things that need to be taken care of on it. But we'll post the video. As soon as I've got it ready to drive on the road, we'll post another video. Until then, we'll sign off for right now.